Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to talk about how to use the Facebook Accept tool in Mass Planner. To access the tool, you just go to Tools, go to the Facebook account, and click on More Tools. And you go to Accept tab. As you can see, the settings are pretty simple, and you use this tool to automatically accept members or new members to your group. And when I say your group, I mean those groups that you own and not those groups that you just joined or those groups that you're just a member of. To make the auto accept tool work for you, what you have to do first is to set the delay time or the wait between minutes before each new operation. You have here the option to send accepted members a message. You can only use this feature if you purchase contact members module. Otherwise, you won't be able to enjoy this feature. Let's say you've already added this extra module to your mass planner. So you can enable this option and what this does is once a new member gets accepted to your group, it sends a message to that user. So all you have to do is enter the message that you want to send to that user in the message text box. You can use a multi-level spin syntax just like what I have here as an example. As you can see, I have glad to have you here. Welcome aboard or thanks for joining. What's going to happen is some of the users are going to receive glad to have you here while others are going to receive welcome aboard or thanks for joining. To check if you have the correct syntax, you just click on test, spin, and tokens. And as you can see, some of them are going to get this message. And if you click again, some of them will be getting this one. Now you can also add tokens like full name, first name, last name, and group name. And they will be replaced by the member's information. So for example, let's say we use um, the token first name. So when you click on test spin, you see that you now have the name of that person. So that's what's going to happen there. The last part is to choose the group that you want to auto accept the members. Again, I can't stress this enough, you only use this tool to those groups that you own. So if, for example, if this is the group that you own, you just click on this. To start the tool, you just click on Start Accepting Group Members, and it's going to accept members to this group that you own. You also have the link for Select All and Select None. So if you click on Select All, it's going to select all the groups that you have here. But if you're not the owner of the other groups that you have in the list, it is better to just individually select those groups. Then you can copy the settings to your other Facebook accounts as well by clicking on Copy Settings. So that's it for the Auto Accept tool for Facebook. I'll see you on the next tutorial. Bye!